and good day. My name is Jürgen Steinmetz from eTurbo News, and this is a breaking news update. For more news updates and shows, please go to youtube.com slash travel news group, youtube.com slash travel news group. Here's our update. 10,000 persons now registered for tourism workers pension scheme. To make a tourism minister, Han. Edmund Bartlett has revealed that approximately 10,000 persons have already registered for the groundbreaking Tourism Workers Pension Scheme since its launch on January 1, 2022. We reviewed the performance within the first month of the implementation of the pension scheme, and I am proud to announce that, so far approximately 10,000 workers have registered, by way of application, for membership in the scheme, said Bartlett. The most crucial part of all this is that in addition to the outstanding work that Guardian Life, which administers the scheme, has been doing in recruiting persons, is the excellent work that Sajikur is doing in terms of building the fund, and we are pleased to announce, the $43 million has been earned by the fund, since we placed it in their management, he added. The Tourism Workers Pension Scheme is a defined contributory plan supported by legislation, and requires mandatory contributions by workers and employers. It is designed to cover all workers ages 1859 years in the tourism sector, with a permanent, contract, or self-employed. This includes hotel workers and people employed in related industries, such as craft vendors, tour operators, red cap porters, contract carriage operators, and workers at attractions. Benefits will be payable at age 65 or older. The government of Jamaica has committed J1 billion dollars to seed the scheme. By doing so, immediate benefits can accrue to qualified pensioners. Sajikar Life Jamaica manages the fund and Guardian Life Limited is the administrator. The Tourism Workers Pension Scheme is arguably the most significant human capital development initiative in the history of Jamaica's tourism sector. It will allow thousands of tourism workers to look forward to a financially secure retirement and is expected to benefit some 350,000 employees in the tourism sector immediately. The vital feature of this pension scheme is that it allows workers to move around within the industry, taking their benefits without being penalized or losing any of their contributions. We are excited that the scheme has started on a very good note and that the response from the workers has been good. We want to urge more tourism workers to support this important initiative. Please get on board and register for the scheme so that we can meet the target of getting 350,000 workers, employers, self-employed people, and any other group connected to the sector to enroll, Minister Bartlett expressed. I commend the companies that are already involved in this scheme, and I encourage the other employers to get on board as well. This scheme makes a statement about a government that truly cares for the people of the country, said the minister. More news about Jamaica. Number Jamaica. Thank you for listening to our news update. There's more on youtube.com slash travel news group. Or you can read us, of course, in going to our news portal at etobernews.com or travelnews.online.